Hello, thanks for joining me to see this video. I have something new to share with you. Um, this is um, something I've made little mini journals before that were decorated with lace, but I thought that it really needed a bag to put it in. So this bag is made of muslin and various laces and trims. It measures 12 and a half by six and a quarter. It has sewn in tie closures on each side. And um, this vintage uh, crocheted um, flower, and I added some bling in it. The inside cover has some trim here. And the journal just slides in. So it's like a clutch bag. Okay, the journal. I'm doing this as a DT project for um, Screech Owl Studio, and Yvonne designed this beautiful kit called Wild Rose. Um, this journal, from the top of the cardstock down to the base of the cardstock here, measures six and three eighths by four and a quarter. From here, where the lace starts to down here, is nine inches. So there's, you know, three inches of of bling here and here for the lace. Uh, I used a, a doily uh, back here and some lace here. A little bit of bling from Denise's shop. This is 49, 49 Market Flower. Uh, the image I found online and I just thought it really fit this journal. Um, and I'm portraying kind of a wild rose. Here's your spine and the back. The closure is with eyelet and snug hug seam binding. This is one of two that I'm going to be making. The other one's in the works and almost completed. But I I had so much, so many beautiful pages. Yvonne gives you 12 beautiful designed pages that you can use and I have a hard time not printing them all. Many of you have managed to just cut back to use a few but I really like this. So let me tell you that um, down below you will find all the stats as far as how I made it and and all the things you need to know, links to shops and whatever. So let's just go inside, take a look at it. I've, I've used tracing paper, I've used um, tea dyed paper, I've used um, parchment paper and things like that. So you'll see lace here and there as I added it. Here's a pocket with a tag and then a little, um, oh, like a coin per, uh, coin pocket or, or a se little a miniature seed, seed packet. And there's a little tag inside or a little ticket. Yvonne put some, gave us some beautiful, I love the detailing of the flowers here and the lines that she gave us. Here's a little pocket that I made from one of the cards. Inside is a tag, a small tag, and another card. This is a glassine envelope, in it, or bag, excuse me, and there's a, another tag. You could also put one back here if you so desire. Some lace added. Both across here and here. Did some stamping, I did some um, stenciling and various things. Corner punches are uh, Martha Stewart. Here's a flip pocket, it's tea, tea dyed. There's a tag from the kit, and I made little envelopes. And inside, here's a little booklet with various tea stained papers in it for your use. I thank you, Teresa LaFriends, because I love these little tags that you included in, in um, so many of your journals and in mine. And so there's that one, and then there'll be the other half on the other side. I also did some, I added some poetry. Here's a belly band with a tag. And this is a, a vellum envelope, and inside is a ticket with a bird. And then these little, some more little pages that you can write in, kind of little secret places. Okay, let's set that down. 
ledger sheet, a little flip up page, tea dyed. The circles come in the kit. Um, I sprayed with Lindy's on some cardstock a while back, and I've been using these, and I'm finally just about out of it, but I added some here. I love the, the color. And then there's some pearls, like on the front from uh, Denise's shop. There's a couple of ticket stack and some little tags. And look at the beautiful imagery. Little stamping. Center of the first signature. Here's a little teeny envelope with birds on it. And a little bit of a little bit of a spot to journal on, even with lines. Some tickets, birds, and a beautiful little cottage. Over here, a little tag, some cards, one with a poetry. This is some, I believe, is some grid paper. I have it in a couple of places, and I love the sound it makes. Another beautiful page. Look at all the lace and the flowers. I printed on some thick uh, cotton fabric, added it in. It's the other side of the tag. More poetry. Lots of places to journal. End of the first signature, starting of the second. You see the beautiful, there's poetry that Yvonne's added and lots of flowers. Here's a poem I found from Emily Bronte, and it's called The Wild, Ro Wild Rose Briar. So I thought it, I'd add it to the kit. Okay. More lace. Lots of fibers and, and um, ribbon and lace in the, in the tags. That beautiful cottage. There's a little tuck with some cards in it. Some more of that fabric that's printed on. Here's the middle of the second signature. And you can see there's a belly band with a card and another little envelope that has a card in it. And over here, we have a flip held together with this little tag, this little circle, some more of the butterflies, and there's room for a tag up here. Another cottage, nice place to do some journaling, a little library type pocket and a tag to put in it. More of that beautiful stuff. Here we go. There's another little pocket with the poem on it. And some more beautiful cards and, and tags. Love the little birds. Okay, here's the back, the inside of the back cover. More lace. Another tag with Tiffany on the back. Tiffany's stamp. And then another little one of the coin purses, coin uh, envelope or small seed bag seed t seed gosh, seed envelope i'm having a hard time girls and guys okay um also i don't know if you noticed but there's lots of lace on the inside of the journal here just to add some interest and pretty while you're looking through and writing in it okay as i said all the stats will be below um so you can read them that way i don't have to go through them all if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. I always enjoy your lovely comments. They're so encouraging. They really are. Um, and if you haven't subbed already, I hope you'll become a subbie. Thanks so much for stopping by.